Hey, today is April 13th, and I am going to update you on the Phoenix Metro real estate market. You'll notice behind me, it's a fairly heavy numbers chart with a lot of rows and columns. So I'm just gonna highlight a few of them, starting out with active listings. Our active listing count is 16,820. One month ago, you'll see up over here in the second column was 18,027. And then over to the right, last year we had 8,953 listings. That is a 155.8% increase in listings year over Next year. Next row I like to highlight are listings under contract. We're slightly higher right now at 9,765. This was compared to 9,137 just a month ago, but we're down significantly from last year where we were at 12,117. That's a year over year decrease of 19 point. You'll notice the V-shaped pattern to this graph. This is our monthly average sales price per square foot. You can see we reached a high earlier in 2020, and then where I am, we reached a low in January. That was $264 a square foot. The next couple months, we shot up and now we're at $279 a square foot for the monthly average sales price per square this foot. This chart shows us our monthly median sales price of $419,000. This is down from $461,000, which is a 10.2% decrease in our monthly median This chart price. shows us our month supply. We are currently at 1.9 month supply compared to 2.3 month supply last month. However, a year ago, we were at 0.6 month supply. The 1.9 month supply still indicates an aggressive seller's market. You'll notice this chart is the active listings count. And many of you have seen headlines or YouTubers post about the doom and gloom and how we're heading for a 2008 crash. Well, You'll see in 2008, we had 56,591 listings. That's compared to 12,117 today. With a population of over or around 5 million for the Phoenix metro market, do you really believe we're heading for a crash? Come on, man, get real. We're not heading. To further the argument against the doom and gloomers and the YouTubers that just want votes and likes, check out 2010 with 5,300 foreclosures compared to today we only have 30. And we'll finish this off with a quick mortgage interest rate update for the 30 year fixed. As of yesterday, April 12th, it looks like we were hovering around 6.42%. Just wanted to say thank you for listening. If you have any specific questions about your current house or about buying or selling real estate in the Phoenix area, please reach out.